Genesis 2 Comics is Genesis 2, which is basically the story of two young friends who grow up to be scientists, and uh, one is a technology scientist and one is does genetic engineering. And uh, from the genetic engineering, here's all the results of his work. And these animals are oversized and they're also bullet resistant. And what happens is the tech scientist is kidnapped by a malevolent tyrant who wants to use her technology to basically create human genocide, total world genocide. So he goes, to, rescues her, or goes, attempts to rescue her with his team of GMO creations. Crazy kind monsters, who are actually uh, one of the characters whose name is Daniel, the protector. So part of Genesis 2 really centers around the, the creations of Daniel, who is a genetic engineering guy. And so that is called uh, Igor, which is Eagle Gorilla. And he has also got some giant growth hormone genes, which makes him a bigger gorilla than normal. So he's 11 feet tall and weighs several hundred pounds. And they're, again, they're bullet resistant. So th this is Ardo, which is an armadillo dog. And again, he's got some extra growth hormone in him, which makes him extra large. He's bullet resistant. And on top of that, he is a bull mastiff along with armadillo uh, armored plates. Our cat friend is part porcupine and part cat. And again, some lion or tiger growth hormone throw in, so he's pretty large too. He has a couple, he probably weighs about 250 to 300 pounds, and he's about six to six feet long, but if you include the tail, he's about eight or nine feet long. So the bad guy is basically a man named Franklin Voigt, and Franklin has basically killed two billion human beings in the last 25 years. He's a really bad dude, he hates humanity. So he wants to finish killing the last 10 billion. So he is trying to create his own group of genetically modified organisms, but not with animals and animals. He wants to do it with human DNA and animal DNA. I started the process with um, a story in mind of just the typical superhero, or maybe just a typical hero, and assistance. We didn't know how it was going to blow up, but we figured that no, we won't do the small robots, we'll actually come up with a different kind of animal hero. So we came up with these hybrid animals. So the graphic novel itself, it's 134 pages, 130 of it is pure comics. And what's happening is, it's you've got to read it like it's a movie. Every page is like a minute of a movie. So it's about two hours long of reading. And uh, it goes pretty fast, there's a lot of excitement in there.